Again, as per the same model of quota, a special factor at the quota is actually education system is based on pure relations between teachers and students. That is the big factor at the quota that is known as a sanskar se safalta, like as a sakaram irinduvari at Chennai too. It means, I hope that they will sure do this. And one thing announced to you, I am plan here four center. Main head office plan at Asok Nagar, then Anna Nagar, Adyar, and Velacheri. Four centers we start from starting, and we have so almost 8,000 students we can teach in this uh, Chennai when first year from entire Tamil Nadu. Yes, sir. In the record, of course. Yes, according to 300 faculty members and staff, we already planned here. And they will come from 31st January onward. They are here present in all four centers. So, uh, a person who can uh, vouch for the success through LN cannot be uh, more than me and Mahesh. I'll start with a story, a very short story about uh, a monk who used to reside on the top of a hill. He had a power, he had a power to tell everything correct, everything right. Whatever question you may ask, the answer will be always correct. So there were two naughty boys in the village who decided that what will make this monk answer wrong. So they made a plan, a perfect plan. They framed few questions. Their plan was like they will catch a small bird in their palm and they will go to the monk with a question whether their hands are full or empty. That was the first question that they were going to ask. They felt that the monk will not know the answer. And if at all they, the monk right, answered it correctly, they were prepared with the next question. And that was whether what kind, what is the thing they are having in their hands. Again, they felt that the monk will not be able to answer it correctly. But then, if at all he answered it right, that you are having bird in your hand, then they were prepared with the third question, and that was whether the bird is alive or dead. So, they, they, they thought that if he answers the bird is alive, then they will crush it to death. And if the monk says the bird is not alive, uh, then they will release it as it is. So that was their plan. They thought that in the third question, at least the monk will answer it wrong. They went to the monk. They started answering, uh, asking the question. The first question they asked, what is there in their palm? The monk answered it right. Uh, is, is there, uh, is there uh, palm, hands full or empty? The monk answered yes, it is full. Then they asked another question, what is there in their palm? The monk answered it is a bird. Then the naughty boys, they, ans they asked the last question that was whether the bird is alive or dead. They were pretty sure that in this question the monk will answer it wrong. But the monk said, you have a bird in your hand as per your wish. You have the bird in your hand as per your wish. If you wish it is dead, then it will be dead. If you wish it is alive, then it will be alive. So the bird is there in your hand as per your wish. So there was a time in Kota when everybody, uh, like Kota is an industrial, uh, had been an industrial town and 
during late 80s and early 90s there was a very gloomy picture emerging in Kota and then people were very sad and then that time came Alan when people started dreaming of becoming uh, doctors. So that was the first time uh, Alan had started making people dream, making people wish. And uh, uh, I have many of my dear, dear ones, friends, relatives, neighbors, their kids who have got into medical examination, uh, selected and got into a very good reputed institution through Alan. And uh, how they do it? They, they, they uh, like uh, uh, prepare students. They are uh, they uh, shape their concentration. They uh, prepare themselves. The students prepare themselves by focusing. Okay, there is another story. There were two ladies who were riding in a car. So the the uh, lady who was sitting in the passenger seat next to the driver, she was repeatedly telling some things, some jokes, cracking some jokes, some something or the other she was telling, but the driver, the lady on the driver's seat, she did not answer a single question. And when they reached the destination, the lady on the passenger seat, she asked the dry, uh, lady on the driver's seat that you did not answer any of my question any of you did not respond to any of my uh, words i think you must be having something more important than me in your mind the lady on the driver's seat she said i have much more important than your words in my mind that is your life and mine so they alan uh, uh, creates focus in the students and uh, that is how they have been successful. I think more than 9.5 lakh students across the country, uh, they have coached and uh, successfully coached. A dream entrance exam, like that uh, G Advance, NEET, AIMS, GPEN, Olympiads, all exams, entrance exam, preparations already planned there, as such, in Chennai, we started here with flavor of same faculty members from the Kota. Our faculties first trade from Kota, then they will shift in Chennai. Secondly, why Alan in Chennai? Behind this uh, question, answer is very simple. In Tamil Nadu state, education is a big asset for the children like that middle order family, they believe in education and after the announcement of NEET exam, in Tamil Nadu need a national prayer like uh, NCIT, CBSC syllabus, experts and Alan is uh, already doing in the this field from last since 30 years. So in Chennai, I hope we will do better here and sure, sure, sure coming in one or two years, Alan create history in Chennai through top ranks like top 10, top 100 ranks in medical, top 100 ranks in IIT ZEE and even a national representation in Olympiad exam and all. I hope so. Alan will do this work very shortly like that in 2020 or 21. So last, I thanks to all for just uh, coming in this session and now next uh, I will just uh, you transfer